know, there's this scripture that has really challenged me, which I want to tell you. When we spoke about Peter meeting Jesus walking on the water, that was the only disciples we know. Even today that he walked on the water. I've never heard any apostle prophet walking on the world. Have you ever heard another one? So it's only Jesus and Peter. Peter said, Petro, I trust you. Jesus said, he said to Jesus, if it's you, I trust you. Make me to walk on the world. That issues of say, if it's you, make me to walk on the water. Peter will say, Jesus, I trust you. It's you. Bid me, command me now. Give me the power you have so that I walk on the water. Jesus said, come. We love to talk about the issue. He failed. Because his faith was weak. I want to tell you this. He prayed and said, Command me to walk on the water. And, and Jesus came. So the Bible said, when he was walking, when he see the effects of the wind, and the waves were coming, he had fear. And he began to see. In other words, he accommodated a wrong power to himself. All the power he was given. When he received after church. But to show that he trusted. The Bible says he cried out. Saved me. You know, this Peter was supposed to have done another thing. He was supposed to have said, but because he trusts Jesus, he cried out. That cry was of trust. And Jesus said, he lifted him up. Because, listen, it's only trust that he would lift you. When Jesus lifted him up, he said, why are you doubting? Why you He was not saying, you are still doubting. He said, why are you doubting? Why are you the reason why you sing it when you doubt it. But the Bible says they, they walk back on the water. They, they walk on the water, going back. Look here. When they approached the boat, they were like this. When they approached the boat, they were like this. Jesus was standing with Peter, facing the disciples. And the disciples, all of them kneeled down. And they were praising Jesus. But Peter was still standing. Peter was not praising Jesus. He was also part of the people who were praising Jesus. I don't know if you are hearing. You are about to be praised by people. But, but don't forget, that praise is coming because you are standing with Jesus. Don't be proud. The praise is coming because you are standing with Jesus. You know what happened? That Peter was standing. I was laughing when I see this drama. You know what the disciples, how they kneel down? It's not what you are saying, you people. Can we get ten people here? Ten people here, they face me here. They face me. Can we get ten people here? I'm Peter. Again, I'm Peter. With Jesus. With Jesus. These are disciples. Can we get the eleventh one? Let's get, actually, let's get Judas. Okay. Actually, Judas, <laughs> let us see. Right. So the disciples are here. We got Judas. Maruti wa shiba le mola. So. Disciples and Judas. But Judas. So the Bible says. Bible here. Now when Jesus. Jesus. After he, Peter got strength. Camera Petro And 
Jesus was, uh, why you doubt it? In other words, Jesus was disappointed. He wanted Peter to walk on the water. And the Bible says, he lifted him up. They began to walk towards but the boat. You people are in the boat. I want to see how you kneel. We'll, cho we'll choose the one who's kneeling better. And, and we say, when we move four steps, it's, it's me, Peter, and Jesus. We are moving. You must kneel. One, two, three, four. So, you saw how they kneel. Peter was standing. He looked at Jesus. Okay, can you stand up? So, you see, they didn't kneel at the same time. But, all of them, they saw Peter walking with Jesus on the water. My God. When now, when they were seeing, they remember it's not only Jesus who can walk in the water. Also the person who can trust Jesus, Jesus can walk on the water. And the Bible says they took steps Look at how the disciples fall. One, two, three, four. And they were praising and Jesus. Jesus. They were not praising Peter. Peter. But Peter was still on the Can you all stand? Thank you, thank you. God bless you. Let us all stand. Prayer with Apostle J.B. Makananisa. Touch your screen now. Listen to this. When you pass the test of trust, people will reverence you. Because they will praise God seeing Jesus with you. They are not reverencing you. They are worshipping their Savior. And they are seeing what he can do to you. Through you. you. Today you can lift up your hands. Many of us today we lack trust. Some of us we are crying God we are failed. We can fix it again today by asking God forgiveness. And we allow God to strengthen us to lift us together. Can we ask Check where you failed him. Confess it by prayer. Prayer. I can't hear you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Can you pray and ask God to give you strength? To do what you are supposed to do. God wants to give you strength to do what you are, you are called to do. To, to obey him, him, to stand where you are supposed to stand. To walk where you are supposed to walk. Prayer. Thank you, Jesus. Sometimes, Sometimes, praise. The Lord sometimes joy singing a was in one sometimes hallelujah sometimes praise the Lord sometimes surely sing our hearts 
in one accord. Hallelujah. Sometimes, Sometimes I, hallelujah. Sometimes praise the Lord. Sometimes joy we sing Our in one accord Sometimes hallelujah Sometimes praise the Lord Sometimes joy Listening out in one accord. Amen. Amen. Keep watching Charis TV.